If you want to get rid of the date from the home screen over here at the top on your Google Pixel 10, then unfortunately it is not possible to do so with the default pixel launcher that we have on our Google Pixel 10. So instead of using the default pixel launcher, we can actually download a custom launcher from the Play Store that allows us to have more customization. Of course, as a drawback, you won't use this uh, launcher. So the home screen and the app drawer may look a little bit different, but as a result, uh, you can actually get rid of the date and even the search bar at the bottom if you are annoyed by them. So if you want to do that, we can open the Play Store, we can go to search, and you can simply search for launcher. You can type launcher over here, and you should be able to find some example launchers that you can install uh, most of the time for free. And there are very different options. Some of them are really unique, minimalistic, and so on and so forth. Uh, but I think the closest one to the current launcher that we have, to the current style, is the Microsoft Launcher. Feel free, of course, to try anything else that you can find in the Play Store. So maybe you can find something um, that you like more. But in this video, we're going to uh, focus on this Microsoft Launcher. So in order to set it up, we just have to press get started over here. You don't have to access, you don't have to give access to location. But the rest is, of course, optional, like, um, like notifications and access to files. Over here, we can grant access to all files. So we can go ahead and open the settings, go to Microsoft Launcher and then allow access. You can also change your wallpaper daily using Bing but we can stick with our current wallpaper. You don't have to sign into a Microsoft account. And then over here, we can just tap not now. And after a few seconds, you should be able to choose your favorite apps, which will be immediately added to the home screen. So let's say I'm gonna choose some example apps like camera, Chrome, let's use Google Drive and Gemini, Gmail. Let's also choose messages and phone settings and perhaps something like, uh, I don't know, wallet and WhatsApp and YouTube. There we go. So after that, we just have to press let's go. And we can set this launcher to be the default one. So you don't go back to the pixel launcher again. So let's press set as default and we can switch to the Microsoft launcher. Over here, we have a small instruction that allows us to go to this uh, page, which is uh, personalized for us. There we go. We have some example apps over here added to the home screen. Of course, you can customize it. You can change the position. You can move them around to different pages if you want to and so on and so forth. And as you can see here, we have the time and date as well. But in this, case, in this case, we can just press and hold our finger and remove the widget completely. So as you can see, if you don't want to have a date in the home screen, you don't really have to have that. And the same goes, I believe, with this search bar over here. And of course, this is the app drawer, which as you can probably notice, it looks slightly different. Um, but if you don't mind, then maybe you can enjoy this launcher more than the default pixel launcher. Unfortunately, this is the only way to get rid of that widget that we had at the top. And that's all. Now, if you want to switch back to the default launcher, uh, then we can go to apps in settings, then go to default apps. And then over here we have home app and we can easily switch to pixel launcher again. And you can uninstall the Microsoft launcher. So that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe.